Steve Smith here with Too Hot to Eat .com. Veterans Day was this week, so I decided what better way to honor the men and women who serve our country than with a little military fireworks. Now, I don't have any personal experience in the military, and uh, you know I've never been in any wartime situations or anything like that. So I can only imagine what it must have been like for the men and women in our field today uh, protecting our country to get something to eat, much less get it spiced up to suit their tastes or anything like that. So in honor of that, uh, today we're going to do some military rations the Too Hot to Eat way. Now what I've got here is uh, what's called an MRE. For those of you who are not familiar with the MRE, uh, MRE stands for Meals Ready to Eat. So I have chosen uh, chili and macaroni for this, and uh, we're going to see how it is. Now, I've seen these things on TV, I've heard about them and all that kind of thing, but I've never actually eaten one. So uh, this is my first time for this. We'll see how this goes. Ooh, it smells really good. I'm just going to dump it in a bowl here. It smells really good. I think I got most of it there. Alright. <clears throat> wow, smells good. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna start out with, you know, the usual stuff. I got uh some crushed red pepper. Gotta love the crushed red pepper. Um some cayenne pepper. That always kicks it up a notch. Especially if you put plenty in there. Okay. Uh my hot sauce of choice today is the chipotle flavor. Uh, it had a little smoke to it. It's really good. So I'm going to put some of that in there. Alright. Here we go. I want to be a little patriotic, so I picked this guy in my backyard. It's one of those that I've had before. But, uh, you know, in honor of uh, patriotism, we're going red today. So we'll take this. Okay. I had a little knife around here. Oh, oh, there it is. There we go. Okay. I'm just going to cut the top right off of this thing. There we go. That. And I'm just going to slice this up. I'm not trying to get these slices too small. Just uh, chop them up a little bit. There we go. Alright, got my little chopper, this thing is always Now again, I like mine kind of coarse, so I'm just going to go with that. That's perfect for me. Okay, I got a spoon here. I'm going to spoon those in there. Alright, stir it up. Now at this point you could heat this up, throw it in the microwave uh, in the field. You could heat it up over your campfire. Um, I think they actually make little warmers for the actual packages of these things. So if you had one of those, you could warm it up. But I'm just going to go just like this. This looks good. Mm. Wow, that was very good. And with all of the stuff that I've added to it, it's actually giving it a pretty good amount of heat. Very pleasantly surprised at the flavor of it. Very good. Okay. I'm going to give this uh, seven peppers on the Too Hot to Eat Burnometer scale. Now, I'm sure you could have got it a little bit higher than that if you would have added a little more ingredients to it. And um, I'm very confident that the hard as nail men and women of our country can take the heat on something like this. But I would be willing to make a bet though that for Charlie, this is too hot to eat.